as I get older, which I will be 54 in a couple of months, I noticed a couple of things and I love it. It makes me, it makes me chuckle. I've been, I'm one who talks about my age. I did a show about this last year where I talk about my age regularly, frequently. I joke and say this is for the old guys. And old guys is almost like for me taking back the the night, so to speak. Um, where like the gay folks took back queer and some folks take back certain words. Um, I feel like when I say the old folks, it means they got the folks who've been around a while and who are seasoned and who have made it through and we're still here. I always talk about being old and older in the sense of for jokes, for comedy, uh, but also for seriousness that I am older. I am in my 50s. I do look very good for an age. I don't know what that means, but I think I don't have that many wrinkles. I have some. I'm not out there trying to get Botox or change it or anything. I don't put myself down because I'm older, but I talk about age. I talk about the aches and pains, all the things that come along with age. Actually, the gray hairs, but you don't see me trying to dye them. But what's interesting is people's reactions. Comments I get on my videos, people say to me in person, younger folks do not like when you say you're old. They do not like it. They're like, don't say you're old. Don't say you're old. You're not old. All that stuff. And, and that's very interesting to me because they're younger, so they have no idea. No, but I think it's fine. I think it's find it very interesting that um, I work in, I because I work in a I work in a society in an industry that doesn't want to talk about age, but it's always a part of everything. Um, I know how many years I have. Well, I don't know exactly, but I know I don't have as many years left as I had when I was uh, 10, 15, 20 years ago. Uh, there are opportunities that are not for me anymore. There are things that aren't for me anymore. Um, and which is fine. I mean, that's, I've moved on. It's just things that aren't for me. Um, there are certain things I don't do anymore that I did for 30, 40 years that at some point grew out of it. I don't want to do it anymore. Uh, but, I just, but I just find it funny, everybody else's reactions. And this is an ongoing conversation I would continue to have when it comes to age because it's it's fascinating to me. There are folks who say, don't say your real age, James. Don't tell your real age. I don't mind telling my real age. I talk about it. I talk about it in terms of my successes. A lot of times, how I started later in life in this particular profession. I have kids and grandkids. Talk about it in relation to them. How they make you feel when you have kids and grandkids or kids in your life. Age does a different thing for you also. I always say when they get older, it's I, every time they have a birthday, I always say, when you have a birthday, I age, so to speak. Because I because just seeing them grow up, they're like markers right in front of you um, of times. And it just, it just age is there. I mean, a lot of them look up to you. It's respect factors. There's something about being an elder states person. There's something about being... Some folks are kicking and screaming about it. Cher, of course, always famously says how she doesn't like it herself. But she looks great. We love Cher. Um, but I just... I just I don't, I'm always talking about age. I'm going to call myself old. I don't care what people think. Um, but I, but it's the it's the reactions. You're old as you feel, and you can't say. I just, I just, I just love the reactions I get from people when I say I'm old. And I also now I almost say it sometimes just because I'm a, a crazy person um, to invoke reaction. Um, but if you look at how I live my life. I'm pretty fearless that I do. I'm doing all these things at this age. <laughs> so it's not like I'm saying it and then depressing in the corner. I'm doing eating my hair, which I could eat my hair. It's very long. But I'm saying all this stuff as I am breaking down barriers, as I am pushing forward, as I am doing stuff. So it's a, it's a, so I like it's very interesting because if I can see if I was doing it the other way, then you go, okay, well, James is. Seems depressed about his age. Right? No, it's like there's just, there are some, there are things that are realities. And f it's funny, the people who are my age, we all call ourselves old all the time, most of the time. We all talk about our age. We talk about our hair and the makeup and, and um, I mean, makeup of our bodies. Uh, we talk about the pills we're taking and the doctor visits and um, how it hurts to get up in the morning. Like we talk we talk about it all the time amongst ourselves. Anybody who's in my age group or older, we talk about it. We're watching our parents die. We're watching our grandparents, if we had any, are gone. Uh, we're either, we're either, some of us are caretaking our parents. 
Some uh, have grown children and grandchildren, even great grandchildren, and are involved in their lives and upbringing. Um, you know, we're not getting out, we're not getting out of this alive. Obviously, this is how we're all going to die at some point. Um, but again, for me, it's the reactions. Uh, if I say something about age, period, in relation to myself, um, I did a show on being call myself fat last year too, and that was another big reaction also um so uh, yes language and words are very important i believe in language i mean i taught all the time and everything i believe in language um when language can be nuanced language can be two or three things meanings at once and language can have gray areas um and language we use for comedy and for drama um but i just i just want to come on and you know for anybody who is, is feeling bad about aging please don't it's life. You're lucky to age. We are lucky, lucky to age. It's, aging is not for the faint at heart. It is not easy. There are a lot of things that are going to come up um, as you get older or may or may not. Um, for some people, it's a relatively smooth ride. But for most people, there are bumps along the way. But if you are age, waking up every morning and aging, that's a great thing. For those who look in the mirror and don't like what they see and you know, and, they, and they're trying to do all this stuff to change it. That's all between you and yourself, of course. Um, but I hope that you are, if you are changing things because you just want to have a certain image, you want to look a certain way because you just like it and it's your choice and not because you're trying to please someone else. I hope that's not happening. Um, you know, and for those of you who don't tell your age, that's fine. I was raised where ladies never tell their age. Uh, but I know some ladies who do tell their age. Um, but I feel like if we just talk about age regularly and just normally, we'll normalize age, then actually in the end, if you're right, it will not matter. And age will just be a number of some sorts. Um, but I don't believe age is just a number. I'm sorry, I just don't believe that story. Um, I, don't believe, I also don't believe that numbers are specific numbers or that there are certain things either. I just say it's a... It's just, it's as you get older, certain, so you, when you pass certain numbers, things do happen. And there are things you have to look for and things you have to, uh, you know, take care of. Um, and it's just, it is, and I know folks who are in the 70s and 80s who move like they're in their 20s and 30s, um, which can happen, you can't do, but also have the realities of the age of the 70s and 80s too. So it's, it's both. Um, so I say, if you're young, enjoy your youth. They say, they say it's wasted on the young as it is. Enjoy it. Uh, but I, again, all the people who are reaction, if you, all those who react to me to my age and say that I'm an old person, very sweet of you, but you want me not to say it or not to do that, but I'm going to continue saying it um, and doing it. But it's, uh, but just know that I'm not bound by it because clearly I do all kinds of other stuff in spite of it. Um, and I want to continue having discussions about the aging process, aging, and all of our ages. We're fine. This is a lot of help with James Lodge Jr. I'm James Lodge Jr., of course. We're everywhere. We're on Facebook. A lot of help with James Lodge Jr. Uh, we're on every auto stream service platform and YouTube at JLJ Media. Like, subscribe, and comment. A lot of help.com is the website, and I will see you next time.